they were about 12 and 25. They played us right down to the wire. We had you know, a great team, and they played hard every possession. And I told the media, I said, I said, this is a hell of a team, and everybody kind of snickered. And then Miami won like 20 of their next 25 games, and, and I think they missed out on the playoffs on the last day of the season. And um, but every time. I've told Eric it's every time we play Miami, I know it's a fight because there's a competitive identity here that exists. And to me, that's why Udonis is here, to, to maintain that legacy. Eric heard what you said this morning about the heat and he passed along similar sentiments about you. Have you heard from a lot of coaches who are trying to maybe empathize a little bit with what you are what you are going through this year? Have you heard from uh, Usually, you, uh, in this business, you kind of... Uh, Stay in touch with your close friends. Um, so the you know the, the guys that I'm close with, I've, I've maintained contact with, and you know you get the occasional text or phone call, and hang in there, type stuff. Um, but I, I've I've learned from a lot of great mentors, and, and uh, I've had a front row seat for for a lot of great uh, coaches and. Uh, so that's why, you know, doing all those TV games all over the years for uh, for TNT helped me quite a bit. And, and Eric was one of the guys I just was drawn to. I could see the uh, just the com uh, the competitive desire that his teams uh, played with, and that's what we're trying to to establish this year. That even though we're four and fifteen, we we want to play hard every night because it matters. Uh, it has to matter. Otherwise, you, what are you about? And so I'm proud of, of how hard we're playing. We've only had one or two games where we kind of uh, got, you know, got, got blown out. Every other game has been really close and fighting and uh, getting better.